King Edward VII, who some called the peacemaker, died in 1910. He was buried at Windsor and in the procession of the finest and highest of men. There were nine crowned kings and thirty proud princes, leaders of many the land. And old Kaiser Bill rode next to King George with his field marshal's baton in hand. Crippin was caught that very same year as Haley's comet flashed by. And the first of the Labour exchanges was open the year the old king died. The Sydney Street siege started in 1911 when anarchy died in the flames in london in june king george and his queen played the coronation game a place in the sun said the kaiser in hamburg launching his new battleships king george made india ireland and wales Places for right royal trips. Titanic was launched on the day of the Derby as London's last horse bus was shown. And the suffragettes mustered, demanding their rights. And in came 1912. Jack George went down into West Bromwich town to welcome the brand new year. And he popped in the pub just to have a little sup Cos he liked his drop of beer And when he'd had a drink, well he started to sing And his voice it lifted high Me name's Jack Judge, I can write you a song And from Albury Town come I Me name's Jack Judge, I can write you a song And from Albury Town come I Now a Brummagem feller who was sitting close by Had heard what Jack did say and a pound to a penny, he says to Jack, that you call right a song in a day. Jack had her to laugh, and he had her to drink, and he said, I'll take you on. This afternoon, I'll write you a song and sing it for the day is done. This afternoon, I'll write you a song and sing it for the day is done. Then he had her to laugh, and he sang another tune, and he bought another beer. And he caught the train to Staley Bridge that night, it was due to appear. That very first day of 1912, old Jack Judge won his bet. And the song he made and he sang that day, we never shall forget. The song he made and he sang that day, we never shall forget. March 1912, brave Scott and his comrades died while the snowstorm roared. And later that year, the good General Booth, he finally laid down his sword. There were riots in Ireland concerning home rule, where his Pankhurst was in prison again. And Wilbur Wright died that first among flyers as the Royal Flying Corps was named. Titanic she sank in the spring of that year, taking 1,500 lives. And the Balkan states blazed from border to border as death began sharpening its knives. Of the 1910 monarchs who mourned for King Edward, in 1913 few survived. Old age, but assassins took many the life. The death came calm to China and Sweden, where elsewhere the murderous hand struck the passion of Turkey and the king of the Greeks, while Spain survived its plan. And the armies of Europe paraded and postured and stockpiled armed weapons in Greece. The high as if in grim desperation they opened the palace of peace. A suffragette seized, in came 1914, an Austrian archduke was slain. In less than two months, 
All Europe was marching, death was in business again. And many's the young man from many's the family willingly gave his all. And they died in their millions for a dubious victory, answering Kitchener's call. And as they rode off to war in their trains and their troop ships, they sang as they hurried along. And the words echo back to the graveyards of Flanders, singing old Jack Judge's song. Yes, the words echo back to the graveyards of Flanders, singing old Jack Judge's song. It's a long time to tipper.